What does your annual benefit statement tell you? Turning your pension savings into retirement income may seem ages away, but taking some time to understand your benefit statement now will help you plan for the future. Your statement shows you how much your pension savings were worth on the 31st of March 2023, the charges you pay us to look after your pension, an estimate of how much your savings might be worth at your planned retirement age and what you could do to give yourself more money in the future. This can help you decide if your pension savings are likely to give you enough for the retirement you want or whether you need to take more action. Let's take a closer look. How much do you have in your pension? Your benefit statement shows you your total pension savings on the 31st of March 2023. Your pension savings have built up from money you've paid into your pension, money your workplace has paid in, plus any money you've transferred in from other pensions. The total includes any losses or gains from investments. What you pay us to look after your pension. We think it's important to be clear about the charges you pay us to look after your savings. These include a monthly administration charge of £1.75, £21 a year, if you have more than £100 in your pension savings. This covers the cost of running your workplace pension. There's no charge if you have less than £100 in your pension savings. An annual management charge of 0.3% of the value of your savings. This covers the cost of investing your money. What your pension savings could be worth when you retire. Your statement shows an estimate of how much your pension savings could be worth at your planned retirement age and the income you might get. We've had to make lots of assumptions, which are all listed in your statement. The amount you'll actually get depends on lots of things, like how much you've saved, how your investments grow over time, and how you choose to take your pension savings. These could all be different to the actual assumptions we've made. The estimate isn't a promise or guarantee of what you'll get when you retire, but it is a useful guide. Ask yourself, is this enough to give me the retirement I want? When you're working out how much money you could have in future, remember to include income from other sources, such as other workplace pensions you've paid into, and the state pension. It's also worth checking when you can start to turn each of your pensions into retirement income, and if the planned retirement age on those pensions fits in with your current retirement plans. To work out how much you need to save, check out the Pensions and Lifetime Savings Association's Retirement Living Standards. These are designed to give you savings targets to aim for. retirementlivingstandards.org.uk How can you build up your savings for the future? Your statement is a good time to think about how you can make your money work harder. Saving more today, even small amounts, could help you get the retirement you want.